matches below. Uh, hi YouTube, bringing you guys another uh, desktop video. Uh, today there was some major announcements. Uh, DC Entertainment uh, just announced over social media that they're gonna make a new Justice League uh, cartoon. It's gonna debut on Cartoon Network, and I kind of just wanted to go over with you guys the article they put up. And there is a one image to kind of show us what the the show is gonna look like. So let's jump right into it. Um, so here's the article on DC Comics. Um, breaking news: Announcing Justice League action. Uh, the Legend returns. Kevin Conroy, Will Boyce, Batman once again in DC's newest action-packed animated series. Uh, this is something that uh, it's super exciting. I, I'm a huge uh, DC Comics nerd and uh, uh, animation nerd. Um, so to hear that there's going to be another Justice League cartoon show, it, it's just uh, I'm overwhelmed and, and super excited. Um, so what I kind of want to bring you guys through this, uh, and it, it's a very small article. Uh, you guys can go read it if you want. Uh, but basically, it talks about how there's, you know, obviously we see the Trinity here, and I, I will go back to this image, but I, 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 like I said, I want to go through the article. But it talks about how, you know, Kevin Conroy is going to be Batman again, and they're bringing back uh, Mark Hamill as the Joker, and James Wood as Lex Luthor. Also, some of the producers and sexu uh, executive producers on the show are from Teen Titans Go!, um, Batman Beyond, uh, Just League Anime Series, Batman the Anime Series, Green Lantern the Anime Series. So it, this is definitely something that DC Comics is grabbing all their their big top guns and they're throwing it at it, and you know obviously want to make this a success. Uh, what I want to bring here is uh, this part. Uh, what are defending the Earth, uh, facing invaders from space, or battling bizarre forces of me uh, magic? The always rotating team of Justice League heroes are up for any challenge. Episodes will be 11 minutes in length, meaning that the action will be tightly paced and exciting and awesome. Uh, so this is very interesting to me just because uh, if you haven't watched a cartoon, there's a new trend uh, right now where it's like the uh, short cartoons. Um, this is something that regular show, Adventure Time, uh, Amazing World of Gumball, and Teen Titans Go! have been doing. Where traditionally a cartoon will have a, a half hour episode, um, and and that will be the, their full half hour block. But now uh, cartoons will have a half hour block, and they'll have two smaller, you know, ten minute, uh, eleven minute, whatever uh, cartoons in it. And it it uh, it goes here to say uh, Teen Titans Go. It's it's the second show that's gonna continue with Teen Titans Go. And if you guys haven't seen Teen Titans Go, I, I highly re uh, recommend it. it. It's really funny. Um, but yeah, uh, what was interesting about Teen Titans Go, it was the first of DC Comics to try this new approach where they they make uh, shorter episodes. I know when Teen Titans Go came out, there was another Batman show called Beware the Batman, and that was a more traditional full half-hour episode. Um, unfortunately, that show didn't, didn't last, you know, and, and for multiple reasons, not just that. But definitely the shorter episode is the new thing, and to have Justice League action take that approach, I think we're already off at a good start. Um, they also go to say that, you know, because it's 11 minutes, it's, you know, it's all going to be action-packed. And I, I think so, too. You know, a lot of the Teen Titans Go episodes, they're, they're very short and direct, you know. Um, and you can see that as a good thing or a bad thing. But uh, going back to this image, you know, just to kind of go over it a little bit with you guys, I want to I wanna zoom in just a little bit here. Uh, that should be fine. Um, so yeah, right here, uh, this logo looks a lot like a uh, classic Just League of America logo, where it's a shield and then says Just League of America. And so I I'm thinking this might be inspired by all like um, all the different types of iterations of Justice League, right? It's not just uh, New 52 or DCU or the modern days. Um, also, if we can zoom in just a little bit more, right here we can kind of see uh, there's an image of, of uh, Hawkman, and right here we ha kind of have the Green Arrow, and we have uh, Satana, and sorry, and uh, uh, Plastic Man. Uh, we kind of see Shazam here. Uh, this looks like the Flash. Blue Beetle, I love the Blue Beetle. He he's super cool. Um, but yeah, so like even though um, even though they're they're only showing. Uh, the DC Trinity right here, uh, you know, both in the image and in the little article, it says 
it's it's going to be a rotating team um you know so it might be these three it might be a whole different three and it might be more than three i don't know um but that's definitely cool uh, uh something else i want to point out in the image alone it's kind of the inspiration uh from the movies uh the movies you know the dc extended universe uh wonder woman looks a lot like the gal gadot uh wonder woman right we have the skirt we have the armor the shield and and the sword so that's that's definitely cool uh superman's costume also looks more reminiscent to the man of steel um and that's simply because you know we know obviously no trunks and he has a yellow belt which the yellow belt comes from the movies while in the comics he has a red belt um you know, and Batman, Batman doesn't look too uh, heavily influenced, but I mean, how how much different can you like redesign Batman every time? Uh, but yeah, definitely, I definitely like the art. Uh, I know art could definitely be something that turns off people. Uh, there was a great show back, I want to say in the mid two thousands, like maybe two thousand six to two thousand nine, two thousand ten. I'm not sure, but it was a, a Batman series called The Batman, and I know a lot of people didn't like the art style and just uh, the uh, they were completely turned off by that, and they never gave it a uh, shot. Um, I loved that show. I actually used to watch it like every Saturday morning, and it was a great show. and I, And I recommend it today. And I was telling people, and I was trying to convince them that they need to get past the art because there's such great stories involved in it. And you know, it. I think this art, it's not something drastically different, so it's not gonna uh, push people away. Um, it's actually very reminiscent to the old Justice League anime series because uh, what I like in the old anime series is that uh, uh, Superman, right? They used to draw his face kind of with these like squinty eyes, and that was to kind of be a callback to the old uh, Fletcher Superman cartoon, you know. And uh, right here, obviously, we see Wonder Woman with open eyes, and uh, Batman, you know, he has those those eyelids. And something that I loved about all, all of the anime series throughout all all of the movies or movies and TV shows. Uh, is Batman? He would his how many expressions he could do was just uh, squinting his eyes and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, it's, uh, so we know that Kevin Conroy is gonna voice Batman. We know Mark Hamill is gonna voice Joker. I hope they get uh, Susan Eisenberg back for Wonder Woman and um, uh, George Newbern or Tim Daly back for Superman. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm I'm, I'm super excited for this. Uh, I'm hopeful that it's gonna be great. You know, I, I think between this and uh, an, another video I did where it's, I'm talking about Hanna Barber uh, comics, it really does sound like uh, DC Comics is throwing all their big uh, guys and trying to make these projects successful. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it and, and just hopeful. Um, the article that says to uh, follow DC Comics and they'll start, uh, you know, for more information and the premiere date and whatnot. Um, so when more information comes out, I'm definitely going to make more videos and, and just tell you guys, but other than that, you know, please comment down below. Tell me, what do you guys think? You know, are you guys excited for this? Are uh, you guys not digging the new, uh, cartoon show? How does the 11 mini block kind of, uh, sound to you guys? You know, are you guys excited for that? Uh, but if anything, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys were entertained throughout the whole thing. And, um, uh, uh Thumbs up if you guys liked it, thumbs down if you guys didn't, and uh, subscribe, and look forward for more videos, so, thanks guys, goodbye.